guys, it's Nicole, and I have a few things to show you guys that I got. Um, I have a bunch of bits of ran like bits and pieces of randomness coming. Some just stuff I ordered Black Friday and different things. But um, I have a, a cherry on top order, which I think was one of them. I think they had some good deals going on and a few things. I took advantage of some of those, and then I also got my Studio Calico kit, and I'll just show really quickly. I won't go into a lot of detail because I know a lot of people show their kits um, on YouTube, so I won't go into too much detail. I just got the main kit, no add-ons or anything like that. Um, and so I'm just seeing it for the first time as well. This cute piece of, it's like a denim ribbon. And it's really pretty washy with the ampersands. These cute like clips with um, like circles on them. These are fun. Ooh, I like these a lot. These are from Twine Ink. And they're puffy stickers, stars, and circles. And then, oh, this is fun. It's like a die cut piece, and these can come out individually. And you can use this, the negative space as well. And it says, be you okay, rad, hey. That's really fun. Here's the stamp. Well, that's fun. That's perfect for like December daily. It's December and then has one through zero. It's a really neat font too. I like both fonts. Let's see. These are... These are fun. They're like little, let's see, like postage stamp inspired. Let me see. But there's little pieces of paper. Oh no, here. Yeah. So you can just, they're corrugated, so you can just tear them and use it. Each individual one's corrugated, each little stamp. How fun is that? So made in Korea. So they're from Korea. That is really fun. Really different. Here, I'll show you guys closer because. That's really neat. So each little stamp, I don't know if it's a sticker or if it's corrugated. I think it's a sticker. Yep, they're each little stickers. How fun is that? And then, um, in the envelope, oops. Just a bunch of, just like, little, um, labels. Like a hot pink, or like a, not hot pink, but like a dark pink and then a more pale pink. So fun. And this Heidi Swap um, stickers. It's like a light blue and then a, like a navy blue. It's really pretty. And then the paper. Um, this is Studio Calico Mount Gigantic and a graph. And then this is a transparency and it's like silver stars. It's from Webster's Pages. Love that. And this is pretty. It's called North Star. It's navy blue and then it has gold stars. You can see those. They're really pretty. The back is white with red polka dots. This one says hello. Purple, that's interesting. Um, I like the purple with the red. It has this arrow along the side. It's just a different piece of paper. And then, ooh, I like that gold chevron on the back. It's like a wood floor. Cassette tapes, I know I have that one already, but I don't mind having that again because I love this one. Basic gray 25th and pine, which I don't have any of this. It's really cool. Basic gray RSVP, which I also don't have any of. It's pretty orange, like 3D block. And then the cardstock is a navy blue, a pale pink, a craft, and a white. So, I haven't even gotten my last month's kit played with yet. Um, I played a little bit with the Christmas kit that I put together. I think I made one or maybe two pages, and then I've just been had to put scrapbooking on hold just to prepare for Thanksgiving and then Christmas and have a big event at my store on Saturday. Not at my store, it's actually our town 
citywide um, craft show, and so that's always a big day for me. So it's, um, it's been pretty busy, but hopefully after this week, I'll have some time. And then I am meeting up with my friend to scrapbook, so I know I'll get a lot done there. Okay, a cherry on top. Okay, these were, I think I, these are mostly all deals that they had available. Um, so this was, I don't remember the, if they have the prices on here or not. It was four stamps. It was really inexpensive, um, if I remember right, but I don't remember how much it was. Um, but you get, they're all, um, this is Dear Lizzie, Amy Tan, Dear Lizzie, Dear Lizzie. And I don't think any of them, this one might be a duplicate, but I don't think I had any of these. So I'll have to check it out and make sure, but that, that was a good deal for stamps. And I'm really bad at remembering what prices were, but so I got those. And then they had some washi tape deals. And I think this must be that. Yes, this is a Tower of Tape set one. I don't remember how much it was either. It, I remember it being very inexpensive, but I loved it for, I love this multicolored chevron. Oh, I didn't even see that one. That's perfect because I have a doggy. Um, this one's like Disney themed and that's really good because I, I still have Disney photos I'm working on. Um, what this wood grain is beautiful. I love the Halloween ones. I love the red chevron. Um, I just used up all my yellow polka dots, so that's perfect. I got a new one of those. So some really fun washies. Cute. That sticker's not in the way. I think there's not a single one out. I this one I'm not a huge fan of just because I don't know what I would do with it for sure. But the rest of them I would all totally use. So that was a good a good buy for sure. And then I'm gonna show that later. And then they had their um, punch boards on sale and I just got them because you know what I don't know I watched some videos and I was inspired at the time and I hope I'll get the energy to like learn how to use them and I think that you could do so many fun things with these um, make your making your own gift bags and things so I got the candy box the pillow box the gift bag one and the punch board or the gift box so gift bag, gift box, punch board, and and candy box. I'm sorry, candy box and pillow box. And then I also already had the envelope one. So um, I'm hoping that with the amount of paper I have, I can really use up my cardstock and papers and make my own things. And I also like to make things for my shop. And so these would be really fun to just have, you know, be able to use these to... I can, you know, make a bunch of these and pre-fill with candy and then sell it at my shop and that kind of thing. So I hope... Um, I'm really excited about playing with those, those sorts of tools. I think I could do a lot with. Then I got this American Crafts stamp and it says thanks. I thought that was really cute. Oh, here's what it looks like here. Um, that'd be cute for a card. Or actually I think my mindset getting it was I can maybe stamp it on my receipts at my, at my store. And then, oh yeah, and then I got... Um, these were on sale. I actually got these for my shop as well because they are, um, they can be brooches. I don't know if you have, must have put the brooch on maybe. And they're, they're really inexpensive and, um, so I thought those would be fun to make into brooches. Oops, there's some pink ones too. Really pretty some pink ones okay. and I got I'm guessing I got I'm not for sure I must have gotten the paper line but this is the my mind's eye cupid's arrow decorative tape it's really cute and then I got American crafts element these are printed wood buttons. Those are really cute. And I got some more of this um, American Crafts, oh, what's it called? It's one of the fall autumn lines. Um, 
This one's called Foliage, but I can't think of what line it's from, but it's just a bunch of die cuts in there. And the stickers. And then I got these thickers. Mommy. Okay, got these red thickers. They're called Rain Boots. They are foam and really cute. And then I got these um, daily, no, I'm sorry, doily thickers. They're printed chipboard and they're banners. And they're actually like chevron, like a chevron wood grain and then the red letter. And then I got oh, the Cupid's Arrow. This is my mind's eye, the chipboard hearts. These are really cute. They are, there's 12 of them, and they're kind of foiled. And then I realized that for my Christmas kit I'm working on, that I didn't have the chipboard sheets, sticker sheet. And um, I caught it because I was trying to do a layout from, I think I'd actually gone to Crate Paper's like blog or whatever, and I was trying to kind of recreate one of their layouts and I realized I didn't have their chipboard stickers so I got that the bundled up chipboard stickers as well as I went ahead and got their 6x6 six six paper pad and then I got the Cupid's arrows um, they are enamel shapes arrows and hearts from my mind's eye And I got the oops, paper pack as well. And it's really cute. Oops, sorry, I got stuff falling on me here. Here. Okay. Um, this is like foil. Here, I'm going to open it. Here's the sticker sheet. sticker sheet closer up there okay and this pretty red chevron sure you guys can see okay here there we go and the cut apart cards and this is all like wherever this red is not yeah just about everywhere this darker red is that's all foil I don't know if you can see that or not so even like here where it says mine that's foil it's really cute arrows and then that has the foil red that heart is so adorable that's cute red hearts and then you have three lines of the of blue hearts and then a foil red and white um, chevron and then like a it's like a tan color love is all you need I love that foil. And the hearts are foil. Okay. And then, just about done here. I got some random papers here. Looks like. Um, the Homemade with Love by Cardabella. Thought that was really cute. Um, I don't foresee me doing a lot of cooking related pages, but I just really love the color scheme and a lot of it with the exception of, you know, the ones with the obvious kitchen themes, which, you know, I have some of those photos too, but I just loved the colors and the different designs and that would be really cute. Um, there's a sticker sheet. The stickers are pretty themed. So. Okay. And then some, oh, I got doubles of the My Mind's Eye. And I got another one of these. And that was it. So that is my haul. Like I said, I'll have a few random things coming in here and there. Um, but I wanted to get that shown to you so I could put it away. 
and um, hopefully I'll be back soon with some layouts for you. Um, like I said, I just had to kind of put a time out on scrapbooking for a little while, um, but hopefully in the next few days I'll get some done. So we will see you guys later. Thanks. Bye-bye.